So, hi dear Aries, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a journal love reading for all the Aries, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising from 5th till the 11th of Feb. I'm sorry about this. Pimple. Yeah. And this is for those who are in complete no contact or no communication and wants to know what's going on and uh, what's coming uh, in from this, that the person's side, their feelings, their intentions and any kind of action if uh, ha happening or the guidance. Okay. And if you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. It's in simple plain English language with lifetime access and certification. If you want to start your self-love journey but don't know from where to start, you can definitely start by purchasing my ebook and workbook. Again, it's super easy to understand, loaded with a lot of information and it's super affordable too. So let's start. Aries, the person that you have no contact with their current feelings for you right now at this present moment. We have the Seven of Cups, the Knight of Cups and the Queen of Cups. Bottom of the deck is the Queen of Pentacles. This person is dealing with multiple energies at the same time. Seven of Cups, Queen of Cups and the Queen of Pentacles, Knight of Cups. This person is definitely dealing with more than two energies at the same time like more like you and other energy at the same time. This person is super confused whether they should come forward towards you or not because they still have a very beautiful kind of attachment um, very beautiful kind of feelings for you but at the same time they are feeling like this is not the right time for some reason this person is feeling like this is not the right time because there is a lots of confusion and chaos going on in the situation between you and them they're definitely feeling a pull towards you at the same time they feel like uh, keeping their emotions keeping their things to themselves because again i'm telling you there's something else or someone else that they are dealing with and they're kind of super confused about this connection between you and them Although they have lots of emotions, lots of care and lots of this kind of energy of I need to talk to uh, Aries kind of energy but they are kind of uh, holding back this urge to connect with you again because of, the law, because of the confusion and the chaos and conflicts going on in the situation. Let's see what this person wants from you, what are their intentions for the situation between you and them, Aries. We have the Six of Wands, the Temperance and the Ace of Pentacles. Their intention is to come towards you with some kind of solid offer. It is this person, uh, either you guys were married to each other or you were committed to each other or something solid was there or not. But they are patiently waiting for the time when they will be able to connect with you and give you something uh, solid on the table, give you a solid offer on the table. Now, it could be very much possible that they are already married to somebody or they are already committed to somebody and they have a connection with you as well they are waiting for some kind of success or victory in their life they are patiently waiting for some kind of success and victory in, in their life in some uh, area of their life so that they can come forward towards you and offer you something solid wow i cannot uh, stop uh, looking at this pimple of mine it's looking very bad so they are re-evaluating the situation they are taking a step back and re-evaluating the situation from a distance and they definitely have this vision of having something solid with you in the coming future. I don't know what's happening but their intentions look good to me, their feelings look good to me. From here, from the cards. Let's see what this person, uh, what action is this person going to take towards you if any by the 11th of Feb, it is. We have the seven of uh, pentacles, three of swords and the page of cups. Bottom of the deck is a four of wands. You can expect some kind of uh, emotional message or communication or some kind of apology. This person is very hurt. This waiting period is hurting them very, very badly. It's kind of difficult for them to wait and wait and wait and do nothing about it. I think if you're not going to do anything about this situation, Aries, they're going to connect with you. They're going to like... Uh, text you or call you like a drunk message or drunk call or something like that emotional message emotional communication or some kind of you can say apology or something like that but uh, it is the thing is that I think it's a fresh breakup or fresh separation like three months max to max or three weeks max to max I don't see it's a distance past kind of a thing between you and this particular person I do see it's a fresh kind of energy like maximum three months or seven weeks or three weeks or something like that but this person is so heartbroken uh, that they can't wait any longer and they will be in this energy of okay let me talk to Aries if they're not talking to me let me talk to Aries because this person down the line wants to have something stable with you let's see the guidance for you guys in the situation Aries
we have the hanged man the eight of wands and the two of cups try to see things from a different perspective from a different angle aries if you are totally madly and like like a crazy person you are in love with this person you must understand that is this love mutual is is like is this is this feeling mutual please talk to this person about all the like uh, uh, all the factors all the feelings all the emotions all everything that you feel about this particular situation try to see things from their point of view and their perspective as well because you might be feeling a lot of love towards them or one of you might be feeling a lot of love towards the other person but the other person might not be on the same page so talking it out communicating properly with each other is going to help you uh, help both of you to come on the same page or find a like peaceful solution to the problem that you guys are facing in the situation there is something regarding communication there is something regarding uh, not coming on the same page that's uh, that's causing a lot of issues between you guys okay the more you guys are going to be open and honest with each other regarding the feelings and emotions and the things i think the more the universe is going to bring you guys closer to each other hmm? this is what i'm getting here so thank you so much for tuning in aries i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste